I think a lot of us can agree that Silent Hills, if it were to have come out at some point or another, the the game, of course, that was teased at PT, uh, that being the, the playable teaser by Hideo Kojima, uh, that this was going to be a new Silent Hills title. I think if that game would have ever come out, guys, it could have been one of the most terrifying experiences of all time. And so I really believe, guys, being a massive horror fan, that it's one of those games that really should have been, and it's really unfortunate that it could not, you know, see the light of day. Well, with that being said, guys, we're getting more rumblings. We're getting a lot of talk that Silent Hills may be resurrected at some point. Hideo Kojima, it sounds like Sony is trying to mend this, this you know, torn relationship between Kojima and Konami. And if that happens, we could potentially get a new Metal Gear Solid game. We could get a new Silent Hills and or just Silent Hill title, kind of bring it back to life at this at this point. Could this happen? We're going to talk about everything that we know so far about Silent Hills and the potential of this game. Will it happen? Let's talk about it. So guys, in an article that was written by Vic Hood of Tech Radar, could Kojima's canceled game be resurrected? And so Sony is reportedly working on two Silent Hill games, a soft reboot and a revival of Kojima's canceled Silent Hills. According, uh, that's according to a report by Rely on Horror, which claims that a trusted source has disclosed that Sony will be the driving force behind bringing the series back. According to this report, not only are the, their plans to soft reboot the Silent Hill series, but Sony could also resurrect Hideo Kojima's canceled Silent Hills game. According to our first source, Sony is working to patch up the relationship between Kojima Productions and Konami in order to resurrect the game due to the amount of buzz and continued demand for it five years after its cancellation, reads the report. So, the report also claims that key figures will be returning to work on the reboot, rumored to be to simply be called Silent Hill, including the original Silent Hill director and writer Kichiro Toyama, composer Kiro Yamaka, and create, creature designer Ma Mashiro Ito. Uh, SIE Japan Studio is also rumored to be behind development in some capacity. And so what I got to say, guys, is look, if we got a reboot and we also got Silent Hills, I don't know how those worlds would like kind of collide almost, or if they would try to merge them together, or Silent Hill is going to be completely separate from that of Silent Hill. How are they going to do that? It would be very interesting to say the least. But the fact of the matter is, is that it sounds like Sony is trying to mend this torn relationship between Konami and Kojima, which could be huge, not only for Silent Hill, but also titles outside of that. With Sony driving the Silent Hill reboot and Silent Hill's revival, it looks likely that we will see both landing on PlayStation 5, but it's unlikely to be anytime soon. There's also a possibility that we may see both being PlayStation exclusives, although we can only speculate on that right now. Now, what I'll also say is this, guys, is that, you know, we see Hideo Kojima has stated that he wants to do, horror, you know, do a horror game. There's been talks that he's been working on a horror game, which is a huge deal. And, I mean, I think he would be great at doing a horror game. Could that horror game be Silent Hills? It's hard to say. I mean, there's very much so a possibility. There's also question marks whether or not, you know, is Hideo going to do Silent Hills and he's going to go back to Death Stranding? Is he going to do maybe Metal Gear Solid after doing Silent Hills? There's so much up in the air. The fact of the matter is, though, guys, is that he's definitely considering doing a horror title and they're trying to mend this this torn relationship. And if, he's, if they're able to, that being Sony... I think Silent Hills could definitely happen. Now, a Silent Hill reboot isn't particularly a surprise, particularly given the success of Capcom's Resident Evil 2 remake and upcoming. Of course, Resident Evil 3 all obviously came out, guys. However, the revival of Silent Hills is somewhat of a surprise. Silent Hills was in development by Kojima Productions. And so uh, for PS4, the game was to be directed by Hideo Kojima and Guillermo del Toro, with Norman Reedus set to play the main protagonist. Silent Hills was announced via a short playable teaser demo PT in 2014, that was free to download on the PlayStation Store. But due to Kojima's exit from Konami, the game was canceled in 2015, and we've been craving ever since. The one thing I didn't like about that whole situation was I didn't like that Kojima took down PT. I, I wish it would have just stayed up, I don't understand his process of taking it down completely so that people couldn't even play it anymore. Didn't make a lot of sense, but um, we finally 
get to pl- we may finally get to play Silent Hills now, but whether Kojima is involved in any way is still yet to be seen. Sony has reportedly offered Kojima full creative freedom should he return to the project. We may be getting excited about two new Silent Hill games, but while the reboot is reportedly in active development, Silent Hills apparently not set in stone quite yet. So obviously, guys, we're sure Silent Hill sounds like it's definitely happening as far as that that soft reboot is concerned. But Silent Hills, the one that we all want to see, it sounds like that is in a limbo state at this point. Now, obviously, Kojima is working on a horror title. We don't know what it is, if it's Silent Hills or something else. Uh, We don't know what it's going to look like. Norman Reedus has also come out and stated that he was in talks to work once again with Hideo Kojima, which could certainly be hinting at Silent Hills. There's a lot of speculation, a lot of question marks here as to whether or not this is going to come to fruition. I know that I can speak for myself and say that I would absolutely love this. Being a horror fan, uh, this would be great. I mean, this is a match made in heaven, guys. Silent Hill and Hideo Kojima, I believe he would have such a great... I mean, just by playing PT, that was an experience, guys, unlike anything that I've ever played, and it was just a teaser. So what I'm getting at is, imagine that as a full game, he could absolutely make one of the most terrifying experiences ever in the, you know, the horror space of gaming, and that's saying something because we've played some pretty terrifying experiences, and so I I just want to at least see it. I want to play it. I want to see what that vision was for Silent Hills. It's got to happen. Sony, make it happen. Uh, I I hope it happens, guys, but I will be sure to give you guys more information as it comes up. And with that, guys, I want to pass the question on to all of you. What do you guys want to see in Silent Hills? Do you think Silent Hills is going to be coming out at some point with Hideo Kojima at the helm? Or do you think we'll just get a Silent Hill reboot? Let me know in the comment section down below. And for more Silent Hills content and videos, stay here with Zero TV.